Hey guys and welcome back. Today I'm going to do an unboxing. I uh, picked up something new uh, for my G.I. Joe and Action Man projects. Picked up this uh, micro flocking machine. So uh, this is something I picked up on eBay. It's, it's really aimed at uh, doing flocking where you would uh, make grass for railroads. Uh, so it's a portable unit. So I'm going to take a look at it, see if I can use it for the purposes of reflocking my G.I. Joes, which I'm thinking I should be able to. Uh, it does come with some some flocking, some grass, and it looks to be about the same material used uh, for the G.I. Joes. So that's a good sign. Uh, the instructions, uh, paintbrush included uh, let's get the main unit out take a look at it so that's the uh, the main unit there and it looks like that's this is what you'd consider the uh, hopper you put the flocking in there and it looks like it has a couple of different attachments so they have the finer the wider and they even do have a more focused one as well so that's pretty cool and I'm guessing this is going to be the power supply now this does require I believe a 9 volt battery and it does also have a power supply take a look at that I'm not sure if you need both or how that works exactly. Uh, yeah, that's the uh, power supply, and this is the uh, the little alligator clip. So basically, you would clip this onto or near the item you want to flock while it's plugged into the unit. So uh, I'm gonna get a uh, something to flock, and we'll do a test on it and see if it works most importantly all right guys stay tuned all right so we're going to do a test run on this just to see how it works i was going to get a little glue got a junk head that we're going to test it on just to make sure that we're getting the results that we're looking for. And I'm not going to try and do a really good job here. This is just a test. All right, so I've got the uh, the machine all set up, and we're gonna give it its first go. We'll just see if it works as a test before I start using it on you know valuable GI Joe heads. So I uh, loaded it up with some flock. Now I'm going to connect it and turn it on. And what I've done is. I basically just set up a uh, screwdriver with the alligator clip which is attached uh, from the uh, machine and hopefully that will draw a uh, electric current towards the head so we'll see if that is actually the case
and I, I don't want to uh, I want to draw the flock to it that's why I'm not dumping it straight onto it but that seems to be working really quickly so I'll turn that off because this is just a test I don't want to waste too much flocking but uh, yeah that seems to be working pretty well it's going right towards it and it's standing up which is uh, the result I've wanted I've been using the uh, puffer bottle which does seem to work well actually I'll go a little further make this test worthwhile and uh, it gets okay results but I wanted a little bit more of a professional result so I think I might be on to something pretty pretty worthwhile here so I'm gonna disconnect that machine is off and uh, take a look here and again I didn't try and do a great job with uh, the painting of the uh, glue or anything just wanted to make sure that the uh, the machine works and it does. You can see the uh, hair is standing up on edge. So uh, look forward to some uh, some upcoming videos where I'll be flocking some actual GI Joes. Uh, so again, the link for this particular one I picked up will be in the description below if you're interested in giving it a shot. But uh, that's it uh, for this unboxing and first test for the uh, micro flocking machine. As always guys, thanks for watching. Until next time.